Good morning guys, welcome to today's episode. This is meal two, meal one. I didn't show you today, but I did show you, show you it yesterday. It was two and a half scoops of MRE light with one whole banana. This is meal two. However, I need to add to this one orange and four baby carrots. All right, guys, <clears throat> I'm gonna eat meal two. I'll see you for meal three. Guys, this cold is kicking my butt. Such a wimp when it comes to getting sick. <clears throat> Just like any guy. So I've got hamstrings today. And yeah, so we've got one scoop of Total War, one scoop of Big Noise. Every day, guys, I use this every day. So something that is going to be different today compared to yesterday's video. Um, one thing that I've been neglecting in the vertical diet is potatoes. Potatoes is part of the horizontal food. You're supposed to have one potato a day. The problem I have with potatoes is that they're just a pain in the ass to cook. Rice is so much easier to cook. So I forgot to put salt in this. So while I'm sipping on this, we are going to do things in a way I haven't done in a long time. It's super easy to cook potatoes in the rice cooker. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to prepare meals four and five. I'm going to prepare all of the rice, uh, potatoes, vegetables. I'm going to prepare all of that in the rice cooker. And then all what I have to do is add my meat to it. So let's get that out. One thing I need to figure out is how many ounces of potatoes I get for that. So it's 13 ounces of raw sweet potato is 75 grams of carbs. So 13 ounces, <clears throat> 13 ounces is what we need. <clears throat> All right guys, so 13 ounces is what we want. This is 13.37, so that will do it. We'll cut the ends off because those are gross. 13.25. So this is going in there. And this way, making everything in the pot, everything will be ready to go, it'll be super easy <clears throat> to uh, have meal five. And meal four will be just, you know, ready to go when I get back from the gym. So I won't have to cook anything. I'll just scoop out half of this, add my six ounces of meat, and that will be my meal. So now we've got to add 90 grams of rice to this. All right, and then we're gonna add one cup of water for the rice. And then the other vegetables that I was gonna have was a, was a zucchini and then a bag of spinach. So those are just gonna go right on top. And guys, a rice cooker, this rice cooker is probably one of the biggest ones you can get. It is only like $40 for this thing. It's so simple to cook with. 
you know, you can definitely cook more than rice with it. It keeps things hot for up to 12 hours. Last on the list, five ounces of spinach. Just throw that on top. Because it does have the 96.4 lean ground beef in it. So we're gonna put 15 grams of this right on it. And there it is. <clears throat> this goes in here. That goes down. <clears throat> and then, you know, unlike a pressure cooker, there's no settings on this. Like you literally, you have white rice, keep warm, brown rice, steam, slow cook. I just hit white rice and it takes care of the timing, whatever, however long it needs to take. <clears throat> but yeah, that's, that's as simple as it is, guys. All right, so that thing is getting started. It's gonna be all cooked and uh, ready by the time I get back. I'm gonna get this down. Usually I like to sip on this thing, but I'm getting short on time. It is 1.45. Yeah, I go work out, come back. I wanna eat this by about 3 or 3.30 and then have another meal at 5.30 right before I leave. Because I gotta work tonight, I have two clients to train at six and seven. Something I forgot yesterday. I bought it and I meant to use it at this time yesterday, but I just forgot. So I ended up just drinking it on its own. But if you paid close attention to the little pictures that I have that I put up between meals to show what the next meal is, one of those meals had pomegranate juice listed on it. And that was supposed to be had with Cluster Bomb and Grunt and Breach and Tango for my intro workout. Four ounces of pomegranate juice. Helps it helps the drink taste better, not that it really needed it anyway, but the thing is, is having that other source of carbohydrate will help the carbs, the cyclic dextrin in Cluster Bomb, uh, absorb even faster. Um, the uh, pomegranate juice on its own is great at is great at clearing the arteries of plaque buildup. So that's another huge positive to it. You know, if we have any issues in our blood flow, pomegranate juice, four ounces a day can help clear that out. It's been shown in studies to do this. So we're gonna use it. Just palm pomegranate juice, four ounces. All right guys, this is our intro workout shake. All these Redcon 1 products you can get by going to the link down in the description box below. It'll take you to redcon1.com and you can use my code T20ChaseI to get yourself 20% off of anything you want on the website. So head over there now if you want any of these things, if you wanna try out any of these products, if you wanna help support the channel. If there's any way that you guys feel like you want to pay me back for putting out all these videos, putting out this information for you for free essentially, the best way to pay me back is going to redcon1.com and trying out a product. I highly recommend if you aren't into like pre-workouts or anything like that, you can't really go wrong with just a basic BCAA or EAA product like Grunt or Breach. Even if you don't think BCAAs or EAAs uh, serve a purpose, one purpose that you can't argue is that they will help your water taste uh, better. And in that way, it can help you drink more fluids, get more water in. So think of it like that, as it's more of a way to help hydrate you more in that it will get you to drink more water if you don't like the way your water tastes. So think about that. Breach and Grunt, they only run for about 20 to $30 each. So if you want to help out the channel, that's the way to do it. So anyways, guys, I am gonna go do my hamstring workout. Probably be back in about an hour. We're just gonna try to knock this out real quick without pulling a hammy. Having this cold, I do feel like I am a little bit uh, dehydrated. So that's something that you definitely want to watch out for and keep conscious in not you know, trying to move really heavy weights. I'm probably not going to do stiff leg deadlifts today because I've pulled a hammy doing st stiff leg deadlifts many times. So. Probably gonna leave that one out. We're gonna stick to things just like standing leg curls, lying leg curls, hip abduction, hip abduction, that kind of stuff. So we're gonna keep it really basic. 
and just try to really focus on the, on the hamstrings. Um, we're gonna do a little bit of calves as well. So not gonna be that hard of a workout, but I'm going to try to focus on the muscle. I'm gonna try to squeeze the muscle with as light as weight as possible. And just get it in and move on. So, all right guys, I'll see you all when I get back. All right guys, we are home from our workout. It was good, it went about as I uh, expected, I guess. 12, 13, 14 sets for my hamstrings. It was a solid workout. From here to there and back to here took exactly one hour, so um, I didn't do cardio because I just, I'm short on time today, so not a big deal because we're bulking and uh, eating is more important than cardio today, so. All right, guys, um, so what I need to do is just add six ounces of flank steak to my bowl, and then I'm gonna take half of what is in the rice cooker, and I'm just gonna dump that right on top. So this is meal four. The only thing I need to add to this is some salt and bone broth. Let's get this salt shaker back online. I hate this fucking thing though. So the only other things in meal four that we need to eat are one orange and four baby carrots. It is 312, so I'm gonna eat this and then I will be back to the same spot in about two hours to have meal five. So I'll see you then. All right, guys, it is time for meal five, <clears throat> which starts with four baby carrots. All right, and the rest of this goes in here. meal five. It is currently 5.15. I'm going to eat this and then I'm going to head to work and then I'll be back at about 8.30 or so to finish out my day with meal six. So I will see you guys in about three hours. I would make a great life. I just can't but women these days don't need to. You don't need to. No, I don't. I just don't. This is 1950. Men raise the children, women don't cook. If the men raise the children and the men cook, what do the women do? What the men do? Out and have time. <laughs> Our work. <clears throat> make some money to pay for a wedding. Something that's an anti-inflammatory that's not in turmeric. 
curcumin. That's all that's in it. That's the only thing they've extracted from turmeric. No, it's not it though. What? Turmeric is not it. So it's curcumin. Everything you described was curcumin. No. Yeah. No. That's yeah. not what it is. I'm going to look it up. Yeah. What are you eating? I always eat. No, it looks different. Yeah. <laughs> 